Hello! So uh, a few days ago in my vlog that I'm trying to do, <laughs> me and the boys went quickly to an Alta that's the closest one to our house which is still a bit of a drive. Um, that day I didn't get much. I had a gift card um, given to me by my aunt who was very kind at Christmas who wanted me to treat myself because I don't end up getting out a lot and if I do it's usually something I'm getting for the boys or grocery shopping. What I really wanted to get was some highlight powder. Um, there was one I had in mind when we went to Ulta. It was the, I think it's Too Faced Prismatic Highlights, I believe. There's a really light shade that I thought would work well since I'm quite fair. I want it to show up. I For a long time I had been using MAC Soft and Gentle and I love Soft and Gentle and it lasts such a long time that, you know, it's it's not real cheap, but it's such a big product that they give you. I've had it for almost two years and I had hit pan but I still had quite a bit left and my older son was playing in it and he took his finger and broke it all out of the dish all over the floor which was wonderful. But that left me without highlighter which is fine. I didn't have any for a while but I really wanted to get some new ones. So I had gone with a friend of mine to Sephora and saw the Too Faced and I kind of was waiting and I knew I had that gift card to Ulta. So I went to Ulta to go pick it up and of course the one by us didn't have any. But the lady that was working in the makeup department who was really nice um, suggested this, I think the company is called Pure and it's Pure Highlight and I think it was a holiday special. It was $32 for um, six colors. This is what it looks like. There is a nice like pinky color here. It's um This color right here is Sunset. It's a really nice uh pinky peach color. It would be really nice for summertime. Um this color right here is Sultry. It is very gold. This is what I found to be the least pigmented of the six colors, but it's still really pretty and it's very subtle if you just want a nice like golden shimmer. Um, this one here is Twilight and this was um, a very frosty pink color. Um, Star Bright, which was a nice taupey gold, very light. Frostbitten was another nice gold color. It was It's really similar to the one above it, Sultry. But it does have a little bit stronger payoff in color, and it's a little bit lighter and frostier. And then Gold Rush is really beautiful. It's definitely more of a bronze highlight. It would be wonderful in the summertime, especially if you've kind of got a tan going, or if you just have a dark, darker skin tone. Um, I think it would just be gorgeous. I'm hoping that I can actually get a nice enough tan this summer to wear it, because it's really pretty. Um, the one I've been wearing most lately is the Twilight color because it's quite fair and I think it kind of complements the um, blush that I've been using. So I've just been using it for a little while. I really like it. Like I said, it was only $32 for all six colors. Sorry about the lighting. I'm trying to get it to an angle that kind of shows off the colors nicest. If you're looking for something inexpensive and then to have options, which I was really excited about when she suggested it, this would definitely be something to try. Um, I'll just swatch these for top three. Okay, there's the top three colors. Sorry about the lighting. I'm going to try and make this video as quick as I can before the light's gone. Um... So there's the color swatched on my arm. I'm going to try and take some pictures with the flash also. Like I said, that top middle color, the top middle color was definitely what I found to be um, the least pigmented of all six colors. It's still really pretty, especially if you want something kind of light and subtle. I'd say they're all really nice buildable colors. Um, I'll try and get some pictures with a flash so you can get a better idea of what you're looking at. Like I said, very buildable. They're really soft and nice. Just the, that one top one was the only one that I, I would say I was sort of disappointed with the color payoff, but it's not bad. I would still use it, especially if I 
was doing something maybe dark around my eyes or lips and didn't want like a really strong highlight. It is a really nice, just pretty gold that would complement your look if you wanted just a little bit of a little bit of shimmer and nothing too crazy. Six colors for $32. Definitely a nice um, highlight palette to try out, especially if you're not sure like what color would look good on you. Then you have more options. It's fun to play around with makeup. That's why I bought it. So I hope you found this somewhat informative. Um, this is my very first makeup review video. Thank you for watching. Bye.